Borrowing from Libby is similar to borrowing from the library. Open the app to the home page and either browse or search for a book that interests you. I enjoy a good cozy mystery when I want to relax at the end of the day, so I go to the mystery and thriller collection. I scroll to a title that looks interesting and click on Joanne Fluke to see her books. The most recent titles are out, so I can place a hold, but I need something to read now. I scroll down until I find a book that is available to borrow. I'd like to know more about the book, so I click on the book cover. This brings me to a page which describes the title in a bit more detail. After scrolling through, I decide to read it. I click the library card. This takes me to a page that tells me the length of time I will have to read the book. I click the borrow button. Libby will then ask how you'd like to read. I have Libby set up with Kindle as my default way to read. I click Read with Kindle. This opens my Amazon account, and I click Get Library Book to download the book onto my Kindle. You do not need a Kindle to read a Libby book. You can read it through the Libby app itself.